Now, it's almost never fun to play the blame game, but apparently there is a group which the nation's top conglomerates think should take the blame for Korea's economy falling into a slow growth trap. Hwang Jie tells us which group that is. A new survey suggests Korea's legislative branch is to blame for the stall in government efforts to spur growth. More than 80 percent of the nation's 30 biggest conglomerates surveyed by the Joseon Ilbo Daily said the National Assembly was stifling economic progress. They pointed to the delayed passage of major economic stimulus bills as the reason. More than half of the companies said they would expand investments and hire more employees once the related legislation passes. Earlier this month, Finance Minister Che Kyung-hwan urged the parliament to pass 30 long-pending stimulus bills as soon as possible. 19 of them have been awaiting approval by the National Assembly for more than a year now. After Finance Minister Che took office in mid-July, the government laid out a set of aggressive stimulus measures expressing concerns about the possibility of a long, slow growth trend resembling that of Japan. If the bills aren't passed soon, experts are concerned the golden time to maintain recovery momentum could be missed. Hwang Jie, Arirang News.